Okay. Um, <clears throat> I know I look goofy. I just got up, took a nap. My neighbor brought me over some stroganoff, and I ate that. Man, it put me out. I don't know whether she drugged me or what. <laughs> but, uh, at any rate, um, some people have been telling me to watch some videos, and I've watched them. And uh, one in particular movie was from the Forerunner 777 um, about JD or JC and a new album he's putting out where, where um, it describes uh, the, the masonry symbolism and uh, what the purpose of the uh, uh, album is and where it's coming from. Um, let's see here. Got a lot, a lot to cover. I have a PDF file that really I want to get out there and I'll put my email up And you guys can email me, and I'll send you the PDF file. I can't copy it, paste it, print it out, or anything. All I can do is read it. Because um, I want to make videos out of it and get them out there. Because it's, uh, it's just loaded with information pertaining to the, this the deception of Satan and his dominion. And um, I haven't read anywhere where it depicts what to do about it, but I have read in the Bible um, certain things that uh, we can start doing to tear down um, his siege walls, his, uh, his dominion. We, we need to tear it down and just uh, get rid of him. Um, so if there's anybody out there in California near the Grove, Bohemian Grove, um, you need to get a bunch of people together and go out there and destroy that, that statue of Moloch and break up the uh, altar where they sacrifice on and yeah just destroy that grove um, and the same thing goes for Persepia or any other symbolism um, idol or whatever even the statue even the Washington Monument is uh, uh, an Egyptian hieroglyph, or not hieroglyph, but an Egyptian, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, Diablo or something, I, whatever. But it needs to go. It's, uh, it's a statue, like I said, from, from long ago, from Egypt. And it needs to go. The streets of Washington are in, in, the, in the geometric um, shape of the Star of David uh, and, and Moloch, the Owl. Um, these are all things that uh, the Israelites took up as gods. Um, anything you have, you, you, your TV, anything you worship. These are all idols. They deter us from from our God and leaning on Him. And we need to get rid of them, plain and simple. Otherwise, uh, we need to get rid of them and put them away from us, be separate from them. Uh, be separate. Um, come out of her, my people. I don't know if this is making any sense to anybody, but uh, it makes sense to me. And uh, we need to destroy Satan and his dominion. 
and make the path straight for Jesus' return. Otherwise, you know, uh, if we're found um, not doing uh, God's will, uh, uh, which His will is that we come to Him, and, uh, and putting away what we know to be of Satan, and allowing these things to occur, then we're just as guilty as, as, as the ones that are doing it. And, you know, uh, the ones that are doing it are under a uh, spell as well. They're, you know, the old cartoon um, from Disney where the witch puts uh, um, the prince under a spell with a, a magic wand and... Or something like that, I'm not sure. But uh, the wand, in order for that spell to be broke, that wand is is broken up. Well, you know, the same same application to all the symbolism and and, and um, altars and statues and idols, whatever. They need to be gotten rid of, and we need to uh, do what the Lord wants us to do. And he says, you know, read it yourself, Exodus 34, 6, uh, 11 through 16. He, he directs our paths, and, you know... To me, there, there should be some application that we can apply to uh, get the job done. So at any rate, uh, uh, if you would, uh, email me and I'll send you that collage of information that's on that PDF file. And you can educate yourself and get better familiar with uh, uh, the wiles of Satan's arrows. And, yeah, put the armor on. Put God's armor on and be able to uh, fight against him. Um, or at least be able to know when you're being deceived so that you can flee, so we can resist him. Um so I'll, like I said, I'll put that email on uh, again, uh, and uh, yeah, let's do this. Let's uh, let's destroy Satan's dominion. Let's make the path straight for God's return, for Christ's return, for the Lord's return, for Jesus' return, for Yeshua's return, for Yahweh's return. However you want to, whatever you want to call him, God Almighty the creator of heaven and earth. Um, yeah, we're, uh, we're warriors for him, people. So let's suit up. All right. God bless you. Say the Lord's Prayer.